Hello guys, who here back in another video, this time around talking about Expertise Quest. I have talked about them in other videos and stuff like that, so I didn't think that it was necessary for making this video, but I want to be precise in getting into Geode because it's kind of uh, important, at least also for the end game, but also for a bunch of mastery and also for the Geode mastery that is also quite important for. So this one is going to be like introduction and from way the beginning all the way to a, a specific point where you I feel you are comfortable going uh, on your own doing the rest of it. If you feel like uh, you're not uh, helped enough, enough, then make sure you put it in the comments below and I will try to uh, help you some more in the comment sections. But, uh, so how do you uh, basically get into your expertise quest? Well, you need the adventure uh, menu and you access that on PC by pressing I. If you play on PS4, you click options and then you go under the adventures and this t uh, menu is going to uh, pop up for you. And of course, you also have your event stuff. You also have your club stuff and trophy and outpost units and the repeatable ones. And repeatable is, of course, the uh, you know star bar and stuff like that. But the ones we are looking for is, of course, expertise. And I'm on my alt account today because that um, the I'm basically on step 16 on my main account. I'm of course I'm done all these uh, a long, long time ago. I always do them as soon as they come out. Uh, but these are all tutorial quest lines that you should 100% make sure you complete. I know I haven't completed this one either, uh, but I'm on step 16 of the Jude one. So the first one is going to be called Go to the Moon Glow Grotto. So if you haven't done anything at all, uh, it will be named that. It will not be named Upgrade Your Gas because uh, mine, I, like I said, I'm on step 16 of this one. I think there is like 25 or 26 steps in total, but it's going to take you through each and every single thing you want to do as for getting into Jude. So uh, make sure you follow this. There's also a gym one I would recommend you also doing for the expertise. But again, this is more specifically on the um, this is more specifically on how to get into Jude. So I'm on the old account. And when you spawn in, uh, first things first is that you want to open up your atlas. And when you open up your atlas, it's going to see it look like this. And then you're going to move want to move down here and you want to go to the Jude Sanctuary right here just click that one and enter and when you then have done that you're gonna get the loading screen and you're gonna spawn in right here that's why i was right up there so it's much easier then you spawn in here and how do you get to the the grotto well uh there's a few portals you can use there but i recommend you just you're jumping right down here because they're right down below right over here there's a few daily quests you can do uh pick them up if you want to but it's again <laughs> that's not what the video is about over here we got the modules bench where you craft the different things uh, you get to craft all of these uh, through that quest line. So uh, you don't start out with the rocket boots, for example, the ones you need to uh, basically run around, uh, moving around in the caves. But they are going to tell you to farm some stuff and all this is in the caves and uh, you will get it through the quest line. So make sure you do the quest line. Uh, next one is to upgrade your modules. Uh, next thing is to upgrade my gas, for example. I need to get it to level three. So I would have to have these materials to, uh, you know, upgrade it to the next step for this uh, quest line. But as I said, the first quest is to go to the Moon Glow Grotto. And that's the one, the purple one right over here. You see, all you have to do is move in and click the uh, portal, uh, click E or press E, whatever you use on the other, you know, consoles uh, to enter things. It will say right here. And uh, you just go in. You can also use one of the other ones, but since we're doing this for the, the, the quest, I'm just gonna click this one that we are actually supposed to be using. So when you enter, uh, basically you start in the loadout se section and it will pop up for you every time. You can enter your relic jewels here, right here, but you can also equip different things. And uh, boots are going to equip themselves automatically when you have crafted them. So you can't, you, I'm clicking my mouse right now, so you can't change these at all. The only thing you can change is your grappling hook and into something else, for example. I could use it to the thumber or the paint, uh, sorry, the paint painter, oh, oh sorry, pa pa path painter, sorry. That was, a, that was a hard word for me to say, sorry about that. But uh, you can swap out these for the other things. The boots are going to be there 
Uh, also, the end shards and this tool and the gas is always going to be there when you have crafted it through the quest line. So you're not going to start off with the boots. They are going to be something you craft through it. You can also add more and you can also add a swap a companion if you had one. I don't have a companion. If you should be so, uh, if you manage to click this window away, uh, don't worry. There, there's not a secret button or anything like that to open it again. You just go over to this guy. He's always here. Uh, you can also move along if you want to, but if you were not satisfied with your loadout, you can open this one again and you can accept and you can also go away and you can actually open it again if you wanted to have something else, uh, if you wanted to swap some of these out. But these are always going to be here and always going to be the max rank of it. So though you don't have to change it yourself. They can be upgraded, all of them. Also, if you wanted some more ridicules, that's all it really have to do. So uh, don't worry if you they manage to you know close this down. But... That is basically it going into Jude. You run the caves, you do what the rest of the quest says. Uh, like I should probably go and upgrade my gas as the next thing. And then just go through the whole uh, quest line for upgrading your gear. And again, I would strongly recommend that you um, do all the expertise quests there is. And I'm pretty sure everything unlocks at level 10. Uh, as your class uh, runs into level 10, they are going to unlock. I don't know if it has something to do with mastery either because all of these has come in after I have gotten more mastery and more levels than that. So uh, if, you, if it doesn't show up for you, make sure you're at least level 10 or level 10 mastery and then it should be popping up for you. And again, make sure you do all of them because some of them are uh, kind of gated uh, behind the other ones. So make sure you do all of them and yeah basically that's it <laughs> not really much more to to say than that so uh i hope you guys enjoyed this video uh i you barely can see my eyes there but i am there but i want to thank you guys so much for watching this video if you like to make sure you guys like and subscribe it helps me out very much and sends the message to more people which we want to to happen anyways again thank you so much for watching and i will see you in the next one bye